All right, so now we're going to be doing the neck muscles for you guys um, for Dr. Sam Sam's Anatomy at UCF. Um, we're going to start right here. This is something you learned with the back muscles. It's your levator scapula. Levator scapula. And that's just so you know and just in case you ask it again. Um, these three muscles right here, 37, 38, and 39. 37, 38, and 39. Those are going to be your scalene muscles. You have your anterior scalene right here. Your... Uh, medius scalene muscle, and then this one back here is your posterior scalene muscle. In between the anterior and the medius, you have the brachial plexus, the brachial plexus, um, and then that's that. When you go over here, more towards the middle of the neck, you have the um, you have the clavicle bone here, and you have the sternum here. And then you have the hyoid bone here. And then this gland right here is the thyroid gland. So those are just some landmarks for you. Um, from here to the thyroid gland, so from the sternum to the thyroid, you have the sternothyroid muscle. From the thyroid muscle, or the thyroid gland, to the hyoid bone, you have this um, thyrohyoid. Thyrohyoid. Come on this side, from the sternum up to the hyoid, you have the sternohyoid, sternohyoid. And then from the sternum up to the, um, this is the sternocleidomastoid, sternocleidomastoid. Because it goes from the sternum and the clavicle bone, sternum and the clavicle bone, up to the, um, the mastoid process on the skull. So sternocleidomastoid. Okay, then right here. Number 32, we have the omohyoid, omohyoid, and that's the superior belly of the omohyoid. And then over here, 33, we have the inferior belly of the omohyoid, inferior belly of the omohyoid. Okay, and then underneath, let's go here, see if you can see it. Number 27. Is going to be the inferior belly, inferior or posterior? Uh, posterior belly. Okay, so this is going to be the posterior belly of the digastric, posterior belly of the digastric, number 27. And then 26 is going to be the anterior belly of the digastric muscle, anterior belly of the di digastric muscle. Um, 28, that's going to be the stylopharyngeus muscle styloid I believe it's also called the stylohyoid muscle stylohyoid and that's the one you should know for the test is stylohyoid muscle um, then going right here is the mylohyoid 29 is the mylohyoid come around to this side number 34 34 is the geniohyoid geniohyoid and then right next to that, number 30, is going to be your um, hyoglossus. Sorry, hyoglossus muscle. Okay, and then I believe that's it. And then on this side, right here, these are the same as the other side. So you have the posterior belly of the digastric, posterior belly of the digastric, and you have the stylohyoid right here as well. And that's it for this model.